Hello viewers, today we are going to learn how to find the compound interest using formula. So we have already learned simple interest. The difference between compound interest and simple interest is that in simple interest the principal amount remains the same while in compound interest the principal amount gets changed every year. For example, for one year the interest will be 100 then that interest gets added for the next year and so on. So let's see how we find compound interest. Formula to find the amount is amount is P which is the principal amount 1 plus rate of interest over 100 times T where P is the principal amount R is the rate of interest and T is the time in years. After finding amount, we need to find the compound interest which is the amount minus the principal amount. So this is our formula to find the compound interest. So let's take an example where principal amount is 10,000 rupees rate of interest is 10 percent and time is three years now we need to find the compound interest so for this first of all we will find the amount by using the formula times 1 plus r over 100 to the power t so here p is 10,000 1 plus 10 over 100 to the power 3. So let's solve this. 10,000 1 plus 1 over 10 to the power 3. So 10,000 times this will be 10 plus 1, 11 over 10 times 3. three times as it is cube so we have to multiply three times 11 over 10 so these three zeros get cancelled and our this is 11 121 so this will be 13310 amount this is our amount now to find the compound interest we will use the formula amount minus principal which is 1 3 3 1 0 minus our principal amount is 10,000 so compound interest will be 3 3 1 0 so this is how we find compound interest using formula let's take another example where amount is question mark compound we have to find the compound interest where the principal amount given is given as 9000 rate of interest is 10 percent and time is 2 years so let's solve this one First we will find amount by using the formula 1 plus R over 100 raised to power T. So after putting the values, sorry I forgot to write P. So now we will put the values here. P is 9000, 1 plus 10 over 100 raised to power 2. So this is 9000, 1 plus 1 over 10 to the power square to the power 2, 9000, 11 over 10 square, 9000 times 11 times 11 times 10 times 10. So this two zeros get cancelled 
and this is going to be I have calculated it as 10890 so this is our amount now we'll put the value in the formula amount minus principal so amount is 10890 minus principal is 9000 so our answer is 1890 this is our compound interest after 2 years so this is how by using the formula for amount and by use by subtracting the principal from the amount we can find the compound interest i hope this is helpful to you thanks for watching please like comment subscribe and share my videos thanks for watching